My name is Emma and I am nine years old. I have been at the Beacon for two years. Beacon is that sort of one-stop, holistic community resource where you can go to for anything. Um, and literally, when I worked at the Beacon, we had people coming in for everything. We'll have the mother in our GED program, the father came to our workforce program, the, the young people are in our after school program, um, different ages, so some are elementary, some are middle school, and now, you know, the, the entire family's thriving. I had no idea uh, 25 years ago that, that we would come to this day. Uh, I had confidence that what we were trying to do was good and appropriate and, uh, and we were going to be successful, but I had no idea it was going to expand the way it has, and I'm very pleased about that. In 1991, we thought that it was needed because, uh, as you may recall, we had uh, high crime rates and we had a program called the Safe Street, Safe City, subtitled Cops and Kids. And so part of the rationale was uh, we've got these buildings, bricks and mortar, already constructed, and, and yet we don't use the schools beyond the hours of instruction, and why not? I was 14, and this is 1989. Um, one of my, I had a friend that was killed. So at that point, this was his second friend that was killed in my neighborhood uh, within six months. And we were going to retaliate. We had an intervention. The director of the community center saw me, and she saw, she's like, Daryl, what's going on? I told her we went inside. All my friends went inside and we formed the youth group, Young Hope. Um, and I was the president of the youth group at that moment. And our, our mantra was turning negative anger into positive action. So we started to mobilize the neighborhood, mobilize the community. We did youth rallies, um, everything under the guise of stopping the violence and changing um, the face of our neighborhood. Well, I think part of what makes it work is that the community decides what they want to do with these programs. And given the funding by the city, it's a it's a win-win. A by being a part of the Beacon program, we were involved in many activities where you know you yourself were able to become an advocate for your community. I think the opportunity to have a Beacon program, you know, in the neighborhood that I was in, um, provided a great advantage for me. I'm proud to be part of the Beacon. Beacon is a magical place.